A new game, sir. Jason, base the game around hot potato. No, sir, give me a main objective. Rolling your ankle. No. Knee reconstructions. No, sir, no, come on. What, what do we need for this game? A basket on a pole, Jason. Right. And a court. Yes. And a ball. <sighs> Let me guess, you shoot the ball into the basket on the pole. Yes, Jason. And you can bounce it off the backboard. <laughs> No, Jason, what are you stupid? There's no backboard. Right, okay, but you can pass the ball? Yes. Uh, long passes? No. No? Short passes? Nope. What? Only medium passes, Jason. <laughs> Seriously? Divide the court into three segments. Okay. And put a semicircle around the hoop at each end, Jason. Right. Seven players will be on each team. Okay, who can dribble the ball? <laughs> No dribbling! Well, who can run with the ball? <laughs> no running! Who can shoot the ball into the basket? <laughs> no shooting! What? Well, only the players with g ah and g on them can shoot a goal. What is that? The C can go everywhere except the semicircles, Jason. And the w ah and w d can go on one of them. This is making complete sense. What did you say? Nothing. So players wear these labels on bibs. Bibs. Sweaty, sweaty bibs. Right. They're really sweaty, Jason. If a player is substituted on, they have to change the sweaty, sweaty bibs. Yeah. Wow. Uh, back to the no running with the ball. Yes, Jason. When you catch the ball, you will catch it dramatically in the air performing a jet A and then you can land with the ball. Right. And the foot that lands on the floor first becomes glued, therefore putting great impact and strain on ankles and knees. <sighs> right, and what's this called? I'm not sure, Jason, but for now, call it women's basketball. But it's nothing like basketball. You heard me, Jason. Right, so if the player has to stand still when they have the ball, can the opposing player just take it off them? Jason, Jason, Jason. Women's basketball is a gentlemanly game. There will be no stealing. What are you on about? What did you say? Nothing. <sighs> Keep going. Jason, there shall be one meter between the person with the ball and the defender. It's an easy measurement to remember. Oh, is it? Well, yeah. Make it 90 centimeters then. <laughs> what? No. Shut up, Jason. You must make eye contact with the line. What line? The sideline. Eye contact? Yeah. When? When you're about to throw the ball back in. Eye contact? Yeah. With the line's eyes? Yes, Jason. Rubbing. Sorry? When defending a player without the ball, there will be rubbing. No, wait, hang on, I don't, I don't understand. You said you're not allowed to make contact with any other players. <laughs> Jason, you are stupider than a boomer trying to send a meme. You must defend with your arms beside you, ish. So you can't stick your arms out, Jason. So to stop a player from moving, you have to rub against them. Oh my God. Jason, I've got a good one. When the only two people on a team are shooting a goal, they make a little Instagram post, their leg up like this. Instagram post, right, what else? The GD and the GK will stretch out an arm to try and stop the shooter. So they can touch the ball? No. No? Yes. So is it yes or no? You can't touch the ball. But if the ball touches you, that's okay. Right. Can you dunk? <gasps> no. Right, so it's a completely different game to basketball. We should call it something else. Net ball. We play this on a basketball court, right? <laughs> yes. You can if you want, Jason. But you'll have to paint some new lines. What? No, no. <laughs> Jason, the netball court shall be 2.5 metres longer than the basketball court. <laughs> and how much wider? 25 centimetres. Really? Really. Gotta go, Jason. Right, great. So I've got written down here, hot potato on an indoor, not so basketball sized court. Indoors? Who said anything about indoors, Jason? This game can be played outdoors. And the only weather that will stop a game from proceeding is... Lightning. <laughs> what lightning? What that would that'd be slippery, sir? Uh, 